Welcome. Here is a rundown of war in Ukraine. Gas price in Europe down by 48% in December to $845 per 1,000 cubic meters. The price of gas in Europe fell by 48% in December 2022 versus the previous month to around $845 per 1,000 cubic meters, according to data provided by London's ICE on January and February futures contracts and task calculations. The decrease was triggered by the abnormally warm weather in the region and a large amount of gas supplies in storage facilities. The price of gas futures reached around $1,558 per 1,000 cubic meters by the end of trading on November 30, whereas on December 30, trading ended with the price of $845, a 48% decrease month on month. The average price of gas in Europe was around $1,272 per 1,000 cubic meters in December and $1,262 in November. Russian aircraft firm masters mass production of Su-57 fighter jets. The aircraft manufacturer in Komsomolsk on Amur in the Russian Far East has mastered mass production of Sukhoi Su-57 fifth-generation multi-role fighters and the number of aircraft produced by the company will keep increasing, head of the United Aircraft Corporation Yuri Slyuser said on Thursday. This is actually the first year of the highly serial production of Su-57 planes in Komsomols and subsequently, their number will increase. We reached more or less substantial production of these planes this year, the top executive said in a live broadcast on the Rossiya 24 TV channel. The Sukhoi Su-57 is a Russian-made fifth-generation multi-role fighter designed to destroy all types of air, ground and naval targets. The Su-57 fighter jet features stealth technology with the broad use of composite materials, is capable of reaching a supersonic cruising speed and is furnished with the most advanced onboard radio-electronic equipment, including a powerful onboard computer, the so-called electronic second pilot, the radar system spread across its body and some other innovations, in particular, armament placed inside its fuselage. The Su-57 AI system assumes some of the pilot's functions, including piloting and preparations for the use of weapons. And North Korea ends year with ballistic missiles launch. North Korea has fired three short-range ballistic missiles towards the sea to the east of the Korean peninsula, South Korea's military says. This latest volley comes five days after North Korea flew drones into South Korea's airspace for the first time since 2017. North Korea has launched more missiles this year than ever before. Washington said the latest missile launches do not pose an immediate threat to the U.S. or its allies. The three short-range ballistic missiles were fired from around 8 o'clock local time, 2300 hours Greenwich Mean Time, from North Wangyi Province, south of the capital Pyongyang, South Korea's Joint Chiefs of Staff said. North Korea's ballistic missiles launch is a grave provocation that undermines peace and stability on the Korean peninsula as well as the international community, they added. The missiles flew about 350 kilometers, the South Korean military said. Japan's Coast Guard earlier said one missile had fallen into the sea. Thank you.